What's going on? I'm Jackson Roberts here with your sports. Hope you're all doing well and continuing to stay safe. The Red Hawks, as you may have heard, snapped a five-game skid yesterday with a 7-5 win over the St. Saint Paul Saints in the first game between these two this season. Hawks were looking to get a little winning streak going tonight at Newman in Game 2. Beautiful night for baseball over on NDSU's campus. Not a cloud in sight. And in the first, John Anderson was towing the rubber for the Red Hawks, getting Mikey Reynolds swinging. Anderson looking to rebound from a loss in his last outing. Same inning, though, Jordan Patterson helping him out with the nice, good old 9-5 to five outfield assist. Check that out. What an arm. Nate Sampson, dead as a duck. No runs in that inning, but in the top of the second, Max Murphy changing that, scoring Alonzo Harris. Murphy, his sixth straight game with an RBI, making it one to nothing. Right now, Red Hawks, I should say, are up four to two when we last checked. Over to Young Field as the Patriots' regular season wraps up tonight, facing Mandon. Abe Hetzelin was the starting pitcher for West Fargo, getting the strikeout early on, making it look easy. In the bottom of the inning, Patriots are looking for some offense. Dustin Mertz giving them just that. The RBI single bringing home Braden Jacobson. And just like that, it's one to nothing. Same inning, Ryan Reynolds. No, not that Ryan Reynolds. This Ryan Reynolds, the one who can drive in runs. He's out at first, but Mertz scores as a result. Patriots, no trouble scoring it all tonight in their season finale. They win 8-2 to two over Mandon. The playoffs are next. Over to Target Field, Twins taking on the Cardinals in a Wednesday night showdown. Bottom of the fourth, 1-0 Minnesota after a Nelson Cruz RBI. Eddie Rosario, first home run of the year. He had 32 last year. That's a career high since coming up back in 2015. Same score in the same inning. Two runners on for Alex Avila. The RBI single for him, that's his first of the year making it three to nothing twins. Rich Hill had a nice debut, five innings, two hits, and two strikeouts, three nothing twins right now in the eighth. Divisional showdown tomorrow for Minnesota against the Indians at Target Field. It's always fun when those two play. You can catch all the action right here on KBRR with first pitch starting at 6.07 p.m. So that will push us up a little bit tomorrow on the news. Yeah, we'll be on about 5.30. Wow. A little earlier.